What is up you guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. I haven't vlogged in a very very long time. If you guys watched my last video you would understand everything so I'll just pop it up here on the screen for you. So hi everyone. Um, <laughs> I hit my funny bone. It is currently Monday. It is 10 30 almost now um, I've been waiting for the power to come back on from load shedding so I can make coffee I couldn't do my yoga today I couldn't go to gym today nothing because I was really tired and I haven't had fucking coffee so gonna do that but basically um, let's talk first about what the vlogs are going to be about so I have officially joined the new you versus you challenge by Hannah Uberg and the own you app so Every single week I'm going to be vlogging basically weekly vlogs in my life but each week is going to be themed on something revolving around this you versus you challenge. In today's video, um, I think for this week I'm just going to kind of vlog getting and easing into it because I haven't been to gym in a very long time at least consistently I haven't been in a very long time and my eating has been completely terrible so one of the biggest things is that I'm trying to fix up my nutrition um, because that has been a very big factor to my weight gain the past few months so we're fixing that up starting with a cup of coffee we are eating good eating healthy not unrealistically that we are going to restrict ourselves to a point where we go through another binge cycle. Moderately eating the things that we still enjoy. By we, I mean me. But if you're joining in on the challenge, then by all means, let's do this. We're going to be training four times a week according to the new or new um, training plan that I'm going to be starting today. We're going to be drinking the water we need to, taking our vitamins. And what else? Um, I have recently got back into yoga so it's been about two two weeks now that I've been um, doing it religiously every single day and it feels so good to get back into the practice so yoga every day and walks around the block whenever I can and yeah so that is it for this you versus you challenge I just got an email now from the lawyers saying that we are officially registered for our house apartment and I know it but now it's like now I'm feeling like but <sighs> my husband and I are officially homeowners congratulations your net bank home loan has been fucking registered people Yay. Are you broken, baby girl? She just came out and just plopped herself on the floor. So whenever she lays like this, we always say, the Aries is broken. Hi, gorgeous. Anyway, so I was honestly supposed to be getting ready for gym. I don't think I'm going to go to gym, which is bad because... <laughs> okay, it's not bad. Stop making yourself feel guilty for things. Just, just telling myself. Um... But I was supposed to go really early this morning, but we had such an eventful weekend, unexpectedly eventful weekend. We were so freaking tired that we could not wake up this morning. And then my plan, like I said, was to go during my lunch hour, but I'm not feeling up to it. My stomach is a bit like messed up from all the junk I ate this weekend. Um, and I really don't want to go to gym feeling so uncomfortable and I'm just not feeling like the mm, you know and if I do go to gym I'm gonna get back there's gonna be load shedding I'm not gonna be able to cook my food and even if I do cook it now I'm not gonna be able to warm it up now I really don't want to buy takeouts today I find it kind of funny that I started this vlog with all the goals for you versus you challenge and first thing I'm doing is not going to the gym
really hope this is good. Yeah. Yeah. So what's up? Yeah. yeah. Well, I, seriously, I logged off work a while ago, um, it's like almost 5.30 now, it ended in a pretty shitty way, let me tell you that, work was just not nice today, just because of certain people, but my washing machine's running, let me pause it when I talk. My washing machine is so loud. This literally took me 45 minutes. So what I what I actually like to do is the, buy the burger patties from Woolworths. So they have the uh, Danya lamb burger patties and then they have the chicken mince burger patties which is actually like just their ground up mince and they season and spice it and everything and it is amazing. So what I like to do is I buy those patties and I split them into quarters and I roll it into meatballs but okay we call it kebabs but um, basically into meatballs so it's seasoned it's spiced it's clean and everything um, all you have to do is cook it so what I did today is I made a pasta Napolitana pasta with the chicken sun-dried tomato seasoned um, ouch, uh, burger patties so I cooked them up, I made them into little bollockies, you can see, and then I made a, a pasta, Napolitana pasta sauce from scratch, and then I made the sauce, dumped these already cooked in, I cooked the kebabs first, and yeah, the Napolitana sauce is really easy as well, it's literally, I'll pop it up on the screen over here, it's diced onions, crushed garlic, oregano or oregano, I don't know, I just dumped, um, thyme, fresh basil and two cans of tomatoes and salt and pepper and chili flakes and just put it all together, let it simmer and then add your meatballs in. And then I just made some spaghetti, so I made white normal spaghetti there because my husband wanted normal spaghetti and then for myself I made the whole wheat noodles. Yeah, I didn't go to gym this morning. So, you versus you day two, and I still have not gotten to the gym. And on top of it, on top of it, um, Mother Nature has decided to freaking bless me with her cramps and pains and discomfort. So, I did not, on top of like the being tired, I kind of felt the cramps and I decided not, let me not push myself to go to the gym um, but now that I'm up and I'm going it's not that bad yet if you're a woman you know um, it, it, it builds the pain builds up but I I'm gonna do some yoga I need a good yoga session I need to like clear my mind because I'm so anxious and hating the idea of starting work right now um, just because of how shitty yesterday went so I'm gonna do some yoga to kind of ground myself and some meditation because the mornings are really difficult right now and I don't know my husband also he woke up and he's like you ready and I was like yeah I'm ready and then we both just fell asleep again and woke up two hours later so yeah that didn't work
guys. <sighs> so, this is where we're at, okay, right now. Oh yes, eating my pasta from last night. It doesn't look like much. It is delicious, but I did um, not make enough pasta sauce to go in the pasta. So I gave most of it to my husband because he freaking loves Napolitana pasta. And I just gave myself a little bit because my portion sizes are a lot smaller. But anyway, I just realized I can't go to the gym. This thing is crooked. I can't freaking go to the gym because I have stuff that's being delivered and shit. And I gotta be home for that because I really don't like um, leaving my stuff with security. So that's a fuck up. <laughs> No gym today again, and that's the problem. The only time that I actually can go to gym without it disrupting and fucking up the rest of my entire day is in the mornings. But I am too freaking tired to wake up to do that. So, day two, another fuck up. You versus you. Still haven't been to the freaking gym, but, but, I did do yoga today, okay? I'm not gonna feel sorry. I'm not going to feel like I have failed because I have not failed. I've still eaten very well today. I've done my meditation. I've done my yoga. I've been drinking my water. So far, this vlog has literally just been me trying to find a routine on how to fit everything in. Hello. Good thanks and you. Good. Thank you so much. Oh, is your exit cold? Thank you. Thank you. Good day. Thank you. Long story short, for some very weird reason, I went onto my FNB app and I went to the ebucks section. And for some weird reason, um, FNB decided to just give me a like a voucher to shop on Superbalist worth over oh a, a lot, like over a thousand rand. I think it was like one one five or something. I don't know. But they gave me a voucher, so I was like, oh shit. And when I by the time I had seen the voucher, it was about to expire in three days. So I was like, shit, um, I kind of need pants for work and I need new shoes for work. So let me take advantage of this. And here it is. So let's see what I got actually. So I just got these slim t-shirts in my basic colors, brown and beige. And then I also got V-neck t-shirts um, in black and white, just the basics. Then I've got a, a chick pants and then I got just a plain black tapered pants for the weird my face not in. Oh, I'm excited and I really hope this fucking fits because even I don't know what the fuck my size is at this point. Wow, I think it might actually fit. Yay! That's what I would have said. Black tapered, ooh. Ooh, this is nice. Oh, so it's like a straight cut. I'm always nervous when I feel like this is not gonna fit. And then I just got three shoes. Um, these white sneakers. <clears throat> just perfect white sneakers that hopefully I can keep clean to wear to work. And I got some cute sandals. I really hope they're comfortable and I really hope they're gonna fit me. Looks like they're gonna fit me. So I just got a white because I don't have a white sandal and I kept it block heel so it's comfortable and also casual so I can wear it casually as well. And then I got this kind of nude peachy sandal. I don't know, it looked really comfy and I think it'll look quite cute with jeans as well. Also block heel still looks cute for work or casual. Um, yeah, that's basically what I got. Hi guys, it is Wednesday in the afternoon now already, um, just popping in to give an update, uh, today is not a great day, I feel so yeah. Um, we're in this annoying full day conference today. And my anxiety is just like, yeah. 
um, so I'm just very very out of it and frankly quite annoyed um, so yeah that's today I did not work out I did not do yoga I'm still in my pajamas I haven't even brushed my teeth I'm just so not in the in the mood to do today so um, I think at the end of this I'm going to log off and do some just self justing to prepare my freaking mind and anxiety for this work event tomorrow. what is up you guys good morning it is wednesday mind you i'm filming this on my phone because i forgot my camera at home but um i made it to the venue for the work session event thing today with our team and i'm an hour early so uh lucky i brought coffee but i'm about an hour it's 7 30 now i'm an hour early on purpose because social anxiety things I was worried about where the place is and now I'm just parked off and I'm gonna sit here for an hour and compose myself before this thing today starts the food better be good I'll just say that but yeah feeling a bit better today compared to the shit ass day I had yesterday um, but I am feeling a bit better also because I'm wearing jeans that fit me and make me feel good so that's a winner and yeah that's a coffee I will update you guys when I'm back home. The filming setup is actually not half bad. Happy Friday. I don't know when was the last verbal update I gave. I think it was in the car on my phone yesterday. Um, it is Friday afternoon now. I don't know how much b-roll I actually got for this week. But I'm going to start wrapping up this vlog now. Because I'm sure that it's been freaking long. And um, it's been an interesting week. So I'm going to wrap it up. But this has been vlog one. Vlog 01, basically, um, of just the you versus you challenge. Obviously, the goals that were set for this challenge, none of them were actually even attempted um, this week because it's been a very weird roller coaster of a week for me. Um, but it's okay. I think I'm going to have some more structure going forward next week. This week was trying to ease into routine, find what I want to do, etc. And I think I know what I want to do for next week. So you guys will see that in the next vlog. But yeah, I'm feeling a lot more comfortable going into next week being my first week of training. But the second week of You vs. You challenge. Remember the challenge is not only about transforming your body and, you know, um, going to gym and eating well and stuff. It has, uh, for me at least, the challenge has a lot to do with my mental state as well. And this week has a lot to do around my mental state and figuring out what I want to do going forward and how I want to implement the goals, not the goals, the habits and lifestyle choices for the next seven weeks now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I have the worst freaking headache ever. 
um, and I got blessed with Mother Nature properly. I know I said earlier in the vlog, but it just, it didn't happen and it didn't come properly. Um, so now I'm like full on cramps and I'm in so much pain today. So that's why I decided to just wash the bedding and just do a quick tidy up in the house, finish off work for the day. And I am going to have a hot air shower and I'm gonna just do what I want and chill for the evening. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and giving your time into this vlog. I hope your cup of coffee or cup of whatever that you started drinking at the beginning of this video is um, finished because I know it was a long video. <laughs> but um, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Adios, amigos.